It's day 66 of Russia's invasion of Ukraine and Russia's defense ministry has confirmed that it had carried out an airstrike on the capital of Ukraine during a visit by the United Nations Secretary General Antonio Guterres. Ukraine said one person had been killed in the strike, the first in the capital in nearly two weeks and which uh, the spokesperson for Antonio Guterres described as shocking. Uma Sudeep gets us the details. Three weeks after retreating from Ukraine's capital, Kyiv, Russia bombarded the city with five missiles, an attack perfectly timed to the visit of the UN chief. The UN team expressed shock at the proximity of the strike, while Ukrainian President Zelensky called for powerful action. Справжнє ставлення Росії до глобальних інституцій, про намагання російського керівництва принизити ООН і все, що організація уособлює. А отже, вимагає відповідної. On his visit to the war hit country, the UN chief admitted the UN Security Council's failure to prevent the war, saying that Ukraine is an epicenter of unbearable pain. He urged international organizations to fix accountability. Let me be very clear. The Security Council failed to do everything in its power to prevent and end this war. And this is a source of great disappointment, frustration and anger. Russia relaunching an attack on Kyiv even after exiting the key city weeks ago raises doubts about its claims of limiting its war goal to Ukraine's Donbas. It again raises the question on when the war could truly end, even after three months of consistent bombing. Priyanshi Sharma for NDTV.